Okay, through him. <gasps> oh, wedding. Huh? You <laughs> <that's good. laughs> yeah, <laughs> that was supposed to be that. That Yay! was um. That was uh. Through okay. a wedding. Okay, that was that was a uh, a reference to Avatar: The Last Airbender. When they so, so in the episode the King of Omashu when they oh. when they beat the King of Omashu you know he he goes up to them and he just and he says hmm throw them a feast <laughs> and they're like what <laughs> that was the idea so like they threw him a wedding I should have gone with that reference oh my god like ah! <laughs> I should have known. Avatar recently. <laughs> That's why I'm so hard. You know, I mean, actually, you know, you know. Fun fact: I actually been bit, uh, re watching some older Avatar episodes. I haven't binged. I haven't re binged the whole series in in chronological order. I just been going back to random episodes and just being like, ah, yes. <laughs> All right, I mean, let's... less than five days. The live action Avatar: The Last Airbender is coming. Oh no, that live action, uh, like the live action one's gonna be terrible. No, yeah. it's actually good. I no, 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 Aiden. I'm, I'm sorry. Well, we You're... don't, we don't know yet. Neither of you know for sure yet. I, know, I saw that but... trailer, and it looks awesome. All right, it's better than the, you know, the movie. The I mean, movie. okay, uh, yes. Uh... Well, I have also said before that there's no way they can go that yeah. it can be worse than the movie. However, trailers have been known to be deceiving at times, but at the same, so at the same time, it could not be. You know, it, 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 could, mean... it could not be deceiving. It could be. That, I mean. Yeah. Netflix did really awesome with One Piece since it got a lot of good views. Okay, to be fair with no and One Piece, lost what? it well with Percy Jackson. Yeah. So yeah. Okay, with One well, Piece, the One Piece, One Piece and Percy Jackson have this one thing in oh common: no. the original creator was involved. Okay. okay. Well, guess and what? The original creators. Yeah, left the, the original creators they... were they were at one point involved. They were involved. <laughs> yeah, but and then the left. Why. And left because Netflix wasn't listening to them. No, they actually no. The original creators wanted to ruin Avatar: The Last Airbender. They didn't want to do the same thing like in the cartoon show. They wanted to change everything about it. But Netflix wanted to keep it to a faithful adaptation. That has been confirmed. But I also have heard multiple times that there's been a handful of stuff that's kind of came out saying. Hey, so you know this in the original? Yeah, we decided to change that or tone it down. So from Netflix. So I have had, I have heard that they don't even want to keep one hundred percent faithful. They do, they this do change. Stuff. Why I'm waiting to find out because there's such information <laughs> that we just do not know. True, but I, I just have a like, like with it. Even if it's good, I worry that. It's go only gonna be good because the original is good, rather than rather than it's good because of anything unique. It's good because it retreads everything that happened in the original. But even then, well, I if that's the case. Then some changes might be welcome in that instance. Mm. I think they're going to change, like for some Osaka's like. If you're talking about psycho sexism, I there is a video about not that. About yeah, that's oh, not, yeah, no, not not example, that. but the idea, of, yeah. <laughs> what I said. I, but not... there is a video talking about why they actually them turning down was a good thing and talking about how that they might actually want to make it last longer. They actually there's a even whole video about this, even though the series hasn't even aired yet. No, because <laughs> well, because, because there's here. also a confirmation that there's still gonna be sexism in after far the last end, but it has been confirmed like there is going then to be a battle. Does it matter? <laughs> because and... apparently people don't read the news article carefully, because Apparently, they like, oh, if they're toning it down, that means they're getting rid of it forever. But then, like, someone who was actually behind the scenes of Avatar The Last Amber was like, uh, actually, um, there is still gonna be sexism. Just wait and see, guys. Like, calm down. Yeah. But, like, okay, but I, but I will say... <laughs> I love the okay. phrasing of that out of context. It's like, okay. don't worry, there's still going to be sexism. No, okay, so, <laughs> okay. but... <laughs> Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. So okay. So bad. Okay. So so I will say the the one the only real thing I'm concerned about the whole saga thing in that regard is how how they handled him and Suki's interactions because obviously part of their early interactions or the meeting was that Osaka being sexist and then Suki humbling him. And then I think they being... can probably they can yeah. probably so they have to have, they have to leave at least enough in 
so that art could happen because that was kind of the whole point with Suki's introduction. Because early 2000 oh, kind of okay. loves my, like episode my, plots my guess, about, you know, a character being my, humble. My guess is that it is that what they'll do is they'll keep the part where he where he like bows to the Kyoshi warriors and has to be trained by them. They'll probably keep some of the goofy things like, you know, with him in the outfits and not being able to cope with that. And that aspect, they just won't tie back into his insecure masculinity instead. And then afterwards, once they get to the scene where they rush away or something, maybe they'll keep the kiss on the cheek. Maybe they won't. There's plenty of time. Suki returns later anyway, so it will yeah. be fine. It, will, it can be salvaged wonder, very easily. I also do wonder if the live action thing, if they're going to dive into like season two and season three. Because like I looked at the poster, for example. You know who's on the poster? Azula and Fire Lord Ozai. Why are they on the poster? That's like, a good if, point. Yeah, you, you, if you, we're you adapting at least, season at least one, Fire Lord Ozai a... shouldn't be on the poster because they keep him in shadow they for a long time. A... They did confirm <laughs> that they're they're going to have Azula in season one. They this but, is all before but the, the whole point of Azula. Okay, no, but Azula comes into season two. After the whole incident at the Eastern Water Trot, was it Eastern? No way. Maybe that maybe they're gonna take like her brief no. cameo in the storm as excuse to have her on the post. It's like ah, there she is, there she is. There she is. <laughs> yeah, because I, she technically did. Cam <laughs> she very much did cameo in season one. I I don't know if she was in the intro in season one as the fire thing. Oh. Uh, no. Uh, but. <laughs> But, like, she very much was in season one as a brief cameo, but that was more, like, forced my joke. and building it up rather than having her as a proper character. Yeah, what I'm, say what I'm saying is they could use that as an excuse. I was half-joking, but it's, it's still possible <laughs> to do it. <laughs> but, but also, I feel... But I also do worry that they're going to drive too much into Zuko's backstory... In season one, just make this a separate video. Do I clip this yeah. and make this a separate video? I wonder. Maybe, <laughs> but like, okay. So here's the thing about going to Zuko's backstory too early. If during season one you go into Zuko's backstory, like because last season two of Avatar was, I guess, giving Zuko a real world experience and learning more about his past and like seeing more. Yes, there was the storm episode where we did learn about Zuko's past. But it felt like we look into a brief window to give an overview of him and how he got into this current situation and how he's currently okay. managed. But I feel like going it too deep into his backstory early on, because at least early on... Have they on, said that they're planning to do that? I don't no. know, but if they do do then that... let's fight! <laughs> no, I'm stating... I'm stating... <laughs> from a, dude, I talk, I talk from a hypothetical narrative perspective. I know, you know, I'm just it's, conscious it's, of the time and the fact that you have to go to work at some point. I don't want this to have to fine, go on for too we long. Do. I mean, I have at least 45 minutes before I have to get dressed, so, you know. Okay, well, in that case, fine. <laughs> just, I, I have let, 45 let, minutes. But yeah, Maybe I'll clip this. This I is my do... excuse to have this as a separate video. Yeah. <laughs> and it, I, I am all in general, well. I have concerns with the Avatar thing. Uh, yes, I do have good. concerns, It too. could be bad. I'm just, and also eight episodes... Again, as a as the episode count is concerning to me. Again, a lot of the whole eight, like a lot of Avatar. If you look back at it, it was day by day adventures. Even just casual episodes had like world building and stuff in it, but like it was the day by day adventures. I'm how still listening. Those... I'm just finding a, a plug. Yeah, how I much, think how, mu <laughs> how much can how much can you keep of those day by day adventures? Because what I makes don't think they what, are. Uh, for, yeah. for, for, con for context, what Aiden is uh, talking about is the fact that Netflix often has very short season yeah. lengths by episode numbers. The thing that hasn't been mentioned is the fact that most of the time, that's because the episodes themselves are exceptionally long and they're yeah. trying and they're keeping the same amount of content. And I so think yeah, it's, it's most likely they're going to be like you know, <laughs> week like by a day week. by day adventure. <laughs> I think they're just going to for the one that moves along with the story. Because, like, with the cartoon, you can do those, like, filler episodes and stuff like that to, like, light up the mood or whatever and not go for the Dark Series well, home for a while. I, I, well, here's the thing, though. In the cartoon, even the filler episodes or the filler episodes somewhat build the world and stuff. Because, like, if you look at the world of Avatar, there, it, like, the creators took exceptional amount of time with the detailing of each culture, each mm -hmm. world, and seeing multiple sides of this conflict. Like, for example, in season one, we got to see, like, 
there were people who were affected by the Fire Nation who weren't good and didn't see anyone in the Fire Nation as good, so was willing to kill them, you know, through characters like Jet. Heck, and then when we get to, like, something like Season 3, we get to learn more about the constant... The constant the yeah, constant, we saw the Jet. Constant, He's the, in it. You know, the constant raids on the Water Tribe and, and how what they did with some of the original Waterbenders. And then we got to see how how all that affected... Oh crap, I forget her name. The old lady in the episode who, who was a bloodbender. Hana? Hana. And how all that affected ah, Hana and her... No. I've never felt more alive. <laughs> okay, yeah, but like, you but you know, but like, like if you the moment you start shortening all of that, you know, it, you end up running into a risk. Like, I'm pretty sure Boomy's in it, so we have the events of. Yes, Boomy. he's in it. But that, but and then that you also got, but you also this. got, you also got to take into account. You got to have a lot of the stuff in season one with Zuko. You got to have the stuff with Zhao. You gotta have all the stuff with you gotta have the stuff with the blue spirit in Zuko. I think all, doing of, all those stuff that you're yeah. saying is going to but be a season that's one. A, but that's if a lot I, of stuff. That's at least half do, a season worth of stuff. If you they do end up cutting anything, uh to to a major degree, not saying that they will necessarily, because the episodes could be, I don't know, an hour each. We don't know. But if they do uh have anything to cut, there'll probably be what was considered even by the main the main team as uh as fun time wasting that's most likely what's going to yeah, go first and also if another, anything does go another concerning thing i i did hear was the oh fact that God. they wanted to take any concept of fun out of the series no like, they're the still having the fun they're still yeah but the fun, like... well i well i heard from some i heard that they did want to cut down on a lot of the funner moments to like do it no oh. they're not no they're not no, that's false. I can I can yeah. confirm this. The, I do recall just, hearing something about like Ang's uh Ang's like the you know, goofiness being toned down or something, but that's only because I happen to see like a vague like article, which again I don't go into because I'm waiting yeah. for the actual show to come out. Yeah, and it, and Look, it just don't listen to the articles for now because everyone has different opinions. Just don't wait listen to, the, to show. the articles. A lot of the articles are talking about statements that the cast and crew have said. But sometimes so, they can be false. Sometimes I know, I know, but I know, I know, but 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 the cast and crew, if the cast and crew are going to be saying statements that make the show look bad or good, people should acknowledge that, and people shouldn't be okay. So what? The director said something looks terrible, so it doesn't matter, guys. No, I'm not, it's I'm just not say, a director. Oh, a writer said. I'm not saying that though. Said, I'm not saying said that. She just never said, liked like that. liked Katara in the series. Oh, oh, please, we shouldn't be concerned about Katara's writing. Like, obviously, a, a writer didn't say that, but just an example okay. of basically pointing stuff out like that is important to be like if a, if the cast and crew was saying stuff like that about the show. It gets concerning, and then being like, "Aiden, whatever you just don't be concerned. Don't, don't, don't worry about it. I'm sure it's fine. Like, I don't it's have faith in the Go ahead, but it doesn't. It doesn't seem. Yeah. It doesn't seem like I this, don't. What all the articles are doing like any good for you in terms of the yeah. enthusiasm that you might have? Yeah. For it's projects. not like like yeah. And I'm just kind of yeah. So it's, again, it's negatively impacting you. Yeah. So that's why we're kind of thinking. Yeah, that's yeah, what. Well, that's why I'm bringing it up days. because it may, it may you people may be able to brush it off, but I can't just brush off concerning statements like that I'm no i'm not saying like you say oh never listen to the articles or anything i'm just saying like don't always trust them because i mean they're, yeah they're all so, stuff saying like oh the cast said this oh the director said this when really it could yeah, be something but, else entirely. yeah so that's all i anyway yeah. let's just we should get back into the yeah. video so, okay. so just one final statement on avatar ah! I, I will watch it <laughs> But if season one is bad, I will not watch it. And I'm just okay. Yeah, yeah I can agree with that. Going saw, forward, like going I forward, but I, th happy. but I have a feeling it won't be good. But I hope I'm pleasantly surprised, and it's amazing. Yeah. Okay, there uh, we go. I, I, yeah, I, I plan to watch um, as much of it as they do pro as they provide. So if season two happens to pick up from a possibly lackluster season one, not saying it will be, but if it does, I will let you know. Yeah, and with that, uh, I guess uh, we can swoop back into this. Uh, <laughs> I and we're back. I definitely watched Avatar. And I definitely knew what you guys were <laughs> talking about that entire <laughs> time. <laughs> okay. Uh... You know what, Emily? Don't look it up. 
if you have if you have access to Netflix, see what you think without Actually, hearing yeah, a single Actually, yeah, watch the original. Thing. The original is on Netflix. It, you know, no ads. Fun times. Avatar's really good. Yeah. There you go. Okay. And, I, and Korra's also good. You'll also you'll you'll also be able to see what I meant by a further Mephist line, which is my segue back into this topic. Yes. <laughs> yes, we're here. Yes. 